Hi, Supersport again. Okay, now we're going to go on to the third and final step. We need, now need to transfer this file to your phone. And the first thing we need to verify is that you have Olipro 130, that's hard SPL 130 from Olipro already installed on your phone. Without this, it's, this step will not actually work. Okay, the next thing you need to do is, is uh, make sure that your active sync is not enabled for USB connections. So I'm going to right mouse con click on the connection down here. Go to connection settings. I'm going to uncheck allow USB connections and say OK. Now you see the red X next to it. That's how we want to be set. Now when you're finished doing all this, um, make sure and change that back so you can go ahead and use ActiveSync again. Okay, now I'm going to open up the MIDI folder. And inside you'll see the Trend 100 NB file that we copied here earlier. I'm now going to connect my phone to USB to the computer. There's the sound, so I'm connected. Now I'm going to double click the MIDI folder or file. And if you've connected correctly, you'll have this at the top. If it's not connected correctly, you'll have COM1 and COM2, and you won't have this other one up here. This is our USB connection. I'm going to select that and say OK. Now I'm just going to hit enter. That'll give me a command prompt. I'll type in task32. That's task space 32. Hit enter. Now I'm going to put in the password. To do this, you type password. Capital B, lowercase s a, capital D, 5, capital S, lowercase e o, capital A, and hit enter. If you've done that correctly, you'll get this pass and the rest of this garbage here. That means you entered it correctly. Otherwise, it'll give you an, an error message. Okay, the next thing we do, and this is our final step, type LNB space TRIN 100 dot NB space 500 A four zeros space 40,000. That's four zero one two three. Uh, that was three zeros, sorry. Hit enter. You see the file being transferred to your phone. If you get this information here, then you've done everything correctly. At this point, go ahead and disconnect your phone from the PC. Reboot your phone. And from here on, your WLAN should be working. Again, big props to GRUPTNT. This was a huge undertaking, I know. And we all appreciate it a lot. Thanks again. Goodbye.